Project Cooper includes many pre-drawn shapes called symbols that you can use in your drawings. You access these symbols in the Symbol Libraries palette. Click the small arrow to open the palette. Let's say I want to insert a door into this wall opening here. I load the Doors and Windows library, and now I have a selection of pre-drawn doors to choose from. I'm going to select this 90 degree door, and I'm going to select the size I want from the Symbols drop-down list of options. To place the door, I simply drag it into my drawing. Now I can rotate the door by dragging the rotate handle just like any other drawing object. And now I position the door where I want it. You'll notice that many symbols have additional grips that you can use to make simple adjustments. For example here, I'm using a mirror grip to change the way the door swings open. Now I'm going to look for a table in the furniture library. Here I can choose from tables, sofas, beds, and more. For some symbols, when you click the drop-down arrow, instead of size options, you get different styles to choose from. I'm going to choose this round kitchen table, place it in my drawing, and resize it to fit my kitchen layout using the corner resize grip. For symbols you use often, click the star that appears when you highlight the symbol to add it to your library of favorites. To view your favorites, you open the Favorite Items library. To remove a symbol from your favorites, right-click the symbol and choose Remove from the shortcut menu. With symbol libraries, Project Cooper helps you create polished drawings quickly and efficiently.